Good morning, friends. It's Mrs. Viriel with your morning announcements. How are you today? Today is Friday, April 23rd, 2021. Hard to believe already. I don't have any lunches to announce this week. Well, next week, end of the week, we'll be back to lunch announcements. All right. So I do have a birthday to announce on April 25th. My friend Levi Vogel will be enjoying his birthday. He's an at-home learner. Um, so happy birthday, Levi. Uh, some national days. It's National Picnic Day. You know, it encourages us to take our lunch outside um, and eat on the lawn or at a picnic table or such. Today seems to be a little chilly for that. Um, picnics can be barbecuing outside. They can be all kinds of different things. So talk to your family about what kind of picnics you'd like to go on. Maybe plan one for the weather uh, when the weather gets a little better. It's also National Take a Chance Day, and I really I think I'm going to take this one to heart. It says it encourages us to break out of our comfort zone, try something different, try something new, um, get something done that you've been wanting to get done for a while. National Cherry Cheesecake Day. Hmm. I would like to call Mrs. Tyndall um, at the high school, the seventh grade math teacher, eighth grade math teacher. She does it all. She makes the best cheesecakes ever, and I'd like to ask her, do you like to make cherry cheesecake with the cherries inside the cheesecake? Or do you like cherry cheesecake with the che with the cherries drizzled on top with some kind of sauce? <sighs> Maybe this will encourage her to want to make a cheesecake. I don't know. She's pretty busy. But we'll ask Mrs. Tyndall what she thinks. It's also National Lost Dog Awareness Day. Bringing reminders to us that there are several families that are missing their dogs and that we can do anything we can help to find those dogs, but also helping us celebrate all the dogs that have been found that were missing and think about the wonderful reunions that those families had when they found their missing dog. I don't have any other special announcements. I do have a quote. It says, treat people as if they were what they ought to be and you help them become what they are capable of being. It's a lot of words there, but um, pretty interesting. Treat people as if they were what they ought to be. Hmm, that's kind of interesting. All right, I want you to check out my sunflowers. I don't know if you can see this, but do you see how the seed coat is still on the end of this plant that's growing? Now these both lost their seed coat, it popped off. This one's been hanging on since Wednesday at least. Um, I'm thinking it might pop off soon. I do think though that when I brought this in my office yesterday, I probably should have watered it. It's getting a little dried out. Um, but these definitely are seeking the sun. When I had them over on the side of my desk, they definitely um, turned toward the window so that they could get more sun that way. So I'm glad my sunflower seeds are, are starting to grow I haven't seen much in my morning glories. We just planted those on Monday. I'm gonna hope by next Monday that we see some action on those. Um, I am really excited about the um, multicolored corn that we're gonna do the second week in May um, and the sugar snap peas. They just sound really fun too. So I'm excited about to get those sales rolling again next week. All right. Well, it's time for us to say look to your family and, and wherever you're working and decide how and when you're going to do the Pledge of Allegiance. And remember, you are super readers and super leaders and you represent Clager Elementary at its finest wherever you are. Have a super great day. We'll see you soon. See you next Monday.